This is sheet pan cooking in four easy steps. Number one, chop your vegetables. You could do green beans, white onions, red onions, sweet potatoes, carrots, asparagus, Brussels sprouts. The options are endless. Anything you have on hand, you can use up. Step number two, coat with oil and seasonings. Plenty of seasonings and plenty of salt to taste. Get that all mixed in. Number three, cut your protein into bite-sized pieces. You have options here. It could be pork, it could be beef, you could do chicken, thighs, or you could do seafood. Optional is to add a sauce, drizzle it on top, and you are ready for step number four. Cook it in a high degree, 450 degree oven. Because you can save on dishes, you get to chillax as it cooks. And then you are ready to serve it up, adding more sauce if desired, and you are good to go. Here's another example of a sheet pan meal. This time I'm chopping up carrots. Remember step one is to chop. Along with my carrots, I also have Brussels sprouts, a red onion, a green pepper, and a red pepper. And for my protein, I found these great Irish garlic sausages that are gonna be so good. But remember step number two is to coat and I'm going to coat my vegetables with this garlic beer seasoning I found along with my salt. Step number three, I'm cutting my protein into bite-sized pieces and putting it on top of my vegetables. Your sauce is optional and the sauce I have here is Guinness Glaze. I used this earlier in the week to make those Guinness Glaze bacon wrap dates and this is what I'm gonna to use to drizzle onto those sausage pieces. Once I'm ready, I'm going to put it in step number four. I cook it in a high degree oven, and then it turns out beautiful like this. Here's another example of the meal with chicken thighs and sweet potatoes and zucchini and fresh herbs from my garden. The high heat this time was my grill. Remember those four steps, easy, chop, coat, cut, and cook, and you have a perfect meal every time.